Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of our family escape. Today we are back at beautiful Portmore. Look at that mangrove behind me. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> we, today we're going to be doing again all ocean things. Um, the weather is kind of weird for Portmore because it's a little bit Sorry for the top, but I just want you to see the beautiful sky. It's a little bit cloudy and while we were coming here, I saw that it rained earlier because there were a lot of puddles and stuff on it. But hopefully it doesn't rain and we get to enjoy this beautiful, oh look at the mangrove, this beautiful beach. First things first, lots of plastic bottles and as you can see, it is not just people coming here and disposing of their bottles. You can see that they're being carried here by the current, by the tie. Um, there is all sorts of things. So the only thing we can solve this problem is if we say no to single-use plastics. As you can see here, there is a shampoo. Uh, gallons it's, so it's just not the drinks and it's not pe persons disposing of their garbage here so guys again say no to plastics whenever you can the environment will thank you and the future generations to have my puppy with me. Yay. Hi puppy. Puppy has carried the entire boat on his back. Ooh. Oh sorry. Oh my poor back. <laughs> Hello. We are on a low tie. Very very low tie but not complaining because I already can see a lot of life under there. And I can't wait to get closer to the mangrove and see what we can find. So join us as we go under. So far, there's absolutely nothing, but there are some piles of sand and I'm so confident that there's some sort of clam or whatever living under there. I want to go for a dig and see what I find. <laughs>
that I just saw a bore.
My dreams in my dreams <laughs> I know and I, I am almost certain that those piles of sand that we see on the bottom yeah. are more of this but I don't know I don't know I'm just so excited <laughs> I saw it open and it closed and it I, I just I can't <laughs> Hold on, we're kind if it's of a um, scallop scallop yes i think it's a scallop well at least suspicious of scallop i don't know it's a scallop i'm so excited <laughs>
such an awesome swim dive is I am not very happy that the water was so murky we got here so late but it's the quality of the sand it just gets stirred up very easily we didn't cut well we also got one fish and he's there scaling and cleaning and Jess is going to be doing that filming while I prepare the fire because we bought we brought some of our favorite sausage vegetarian sausage by Beyond Meat and I have the fire right here setting up right there and I'm gonna get some sticks to set up a grill um, set the fire and then I'll show you all of that I'm filming with my phone so I hope it's good quality <laughs> five sticks the knife did did it thin though i mean it's not all that but it did it thin <laughs> all right let's get the fire going vegetarian sausage and this is my first time cooking it like this whole I always do what I show you before I just cut them in small pieces and do it in a pot sometimes I add onions and tomatoes but this is my first time trying it like this and I have some planting here but I realize the planting is not ripe enough so I'm not sure if it's going to work out this one was not ready yet so we'll see
Mm. Oh my goodness. Mm. This is very good because a lot of the fat and flavor of the sausage get lost in the when you fry it up. And then right now all of that goodness is in the casing. Mm -hmm. So you can see you can feel the seasoned taste of it. Mm. And it doesn't need Natural. anything. It just doesn't need anything. Just plant it. Just like that. Before I go, I just want to take a last look at this ocean. Ooh, so beautiful. I wish we had enough bags to carry all these bottles with us. I wish we also had space in the truck. But we don't have a lot, so we're just doing one bag, which is what we carry. Still need to finish packing up, but we have packed up most of the things already. Very important to put out your fire always. Oh, the whole yeah, because it's very dry. Thank you, people. Alright guys, I am very happy that I got to come to the beach today. The entire family had a blast. It was a very short trip, but very fruitful. We got to see nice life underwater. Unfortunately, we cannot get away from the garbage anywhere we go. We enjoy that beautiful mangrove behind me. I got some nice underwater footage for you that hopefully you get to enjoy. We got to enjoy that nice beyond sausage. We didn't catch a lot of fish, but next time hopefully we'll have better luck. So I cannot wait to see you all again on the next escape. Bye! Bye. Bye everybody. Mm -hmm.